If you don't like the video in the next five seconds, then this spider will appear on your bed. What's going on guys, it's Nathan here back with another video. Today I'm going to be showing you guys how to get, or not how to get, but how to set up a, a fairly new script executor called Proto Smasher. Now, this does cost money, I know, I know, it costs money, yes, but most good, actually all good script executors cost money. Um, when you go to the Proto Smasher website, you see like a purchase option, and once you buy it and it says successful, and you have this screen right here, what you're gonna do is you're gonna click Go to Dashboard. Um, you're going to click Whitelist, and you're going to click I'm a human, and you're gonna complete the captcha. But I already did, and you're only allowed to change your whitelist once every 24 hours, and I haven't had this for 24 hours yet. But as you can see right here, it will send you an email. Oops. Send you an email that you have the thing, and as you can see right here, it set it shows the key, the whitelist key, and yeah. And I'm probably gonna censor this out right here because I don't want you guys to see my whitelist key. But anyways, yeah. Once you see all that, you're gonna click download, and it says the file will download. But since I already have it downloaded, I don't need to do that. Um, after that, what you're going to do is you're going to pick out your favorite Roblox game or whatever, whatever game that you want. And you're probably wondering, how do I execute my scripts? So I'm just going to do a... I don't really know what script to do. I kind of want to do an easy script. So let me go into my other account real quick. Hold on. Alright, now that I'm back in my other account, let's just do a simple Murder Mystery 2 script, okay? So what we're going to do is we're going to find a... This is my favorite Murder Mystery 2 script. I will leave a link in the description to this. Um, this isn't really a script tutorial, this is just a tutorial on Proto Smasher. So. Once you have Roblox open, you must o open Roblox first. You're going to open the Proto Smasher folder. Um, you don't have to do this, but what I like to do is open up Proto Smasher app, and you click update it and down click download the latest update. And if you haven't done anything in a while, if you haven't downloaded this in a while, it will just download the latest update of it. Um, but since I already have the latest one, it's not really going to do anything. So once you have Roblox open, you're going to open up Proto Smasher, and it should say injected closing in three seconds. And after it closes, what you're going to do is, oh, I am already in a game. You can see down here, it says Proto Smasher V3.2.3G. And what I'm going to do is, you're probably wondering, okay, now I got this injected. What do I do next? How do I open the script executor? What you're going to do is you're going to click Insert, and it opens up this console thing right here. And to execute a script, you just, type, you just click in this little box, and you click Control-V. Great, not again. I hate it when this happens. Um, if that, if you, if this ever happens to you where you can't type in anything, what you have to do is you have to just open Roblox a second time. Sometimes, right after you download the update, it doesn't work for a second, but it, it works. It works eventually. Okay, just a little trial and error. So, and you also might want to wait until whatever game you're in finish finishes loading after before you inject it. Um. Because if you inject it before, um, then it'll freeze the game because it detects that you're hacking something. But anyways, so let's try this again. We go into here, Control-V, there we go. As you can see here, we've got our script loaded. Click Execute, and right right down here, we have got our script. Um, this isn't really going to be a script tutorial, but I'm just kind of kind of going to show you guys what you get this is a level six script executor so it should work to it so if you just teleport to them just this teleport to map oh I can't pick up the gun because I'm dead but I'm gonna teleport to the murderer oh here he is uh, the, gl the thing the glitchy thing about being dead and then coming back into the thing is that 
nobody can kill you. And you can't pick up the gun, shoot anybody, but it's kind of fun to just mess around with people. You can still collect coins, though, but they don't really do anything. Okay. There we go. Okay. Um, so, yeah, it, this one has no clip. Um, I can teleport to the map. Um, you can only teleport to the map after it loads in. Um, we have the gun grabber, which just teleports you after the thing is broken. We've got fly hacks. You just fly wherever we want. We can turn no clip on. Just kind of walk out of bounds. And mess with people. But, um, yeah, the, if, if you were having trouble um, with uh, Proto Smasher, then um then I hope this helped you out if you were having trouble with it. It's this one has Sheriff and Murder ESP. It only works when the game is started. But um yeah that's about that's about it that I have to say. Um if you enjoyed this video don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. If you have any questions then go ahead and leave them in the comment section below and uh peace out.